Watching your pets suffer in pain is difficult. Chronic pain, either from accidents or old age, is one of the most common reasons dogs are put down. It's something no pet owner ever wants to face, but one experimental treatment is now giving a second chance at life to dogs uh, in pain. Like most moms, Taryn Sargent loves her dog Shane. We're just a part of each other's world. A car accident 20 years ago left Taryn with a brain injury and seizures she'll probably never fully recover from. For the last decade, Shane has been by her the side. The comfort I get from Shane and is just... Eight years ago, Shane was in a car accident too. Instead of taking him for a 10 minute walk to go to the bathroom, he could go for five minutes and then I'd be carrying him home. Desperate for help, Taryn found Rob Landry, who's sick of putting dogs down because of pain. They don't complain, they don't necessarily vocalize it, but they socially become recluse, they hide, they sleep, they don't, they're not involved. Landry teamed up with neuroscientist Linda Watkins, who developed an experimental gene therapy. So the dog cells become the factories that make the therapeutic. They're releasing this anti-inflammatory cytokine. It is a one-time injection into the joint. And after treatment, they get their doghood back. And it is so amazing to see. Shane was treated two years ago. Like we want them to live their lives, not ex just exist. And this kid's living his life now. Like, there's no doubt to me. He can't confirm, but Shane's actions speak volumes. He went from being, you know, a 12 or 13-year-old dog to a two-year-old dog. <laughs> Now, this treatment has not been FDA approved, but it's been so promising that this same therapy is now in clinical trials for chronic pain in humans in Australia and California.